Welcome to Paint TV. I'm Emily Howard, Editor-in-Chief of American Painting Contractor. We are out here in the beautiful Breckenridge, Colorado. We're meeting up with Allman Painting. They're doing a condo repaint over here just over Lake Dillon, and they're going to show you how to use the new Hyde Quick Reach Telescoping Spray Pole. My name is Ryan Schroeder. I uh, run Almond Painting up in Summit County, Colorado. Right now we're sitting between Keystone and Dillon up at one of our big HOA projects in Summerwood. So the building we're on is a big commercial repaint. We do a lot of HOA work and big commercial stuff up here as well as some residential and some light industrial work. Obviously my goal at the end of the day is everybody goes home safe to their families. You know, out here on this site, every time we set up or take down a ladder, you know, we're having to dig a hole in the ground to level out the hill over here because the rocks and the side of the hill are so unstable. We can't put ladder levelers and trust our adjustable feet. You know, the best way to set up these big ladders is to dig into the side of the hill and make sure you have a nice flat level surface. So, you know, the hide pole just makes it so we don't have to move our ladders as much and dig around in the dirt and we can keep painting. So we're gonna set up our spray pole here. We have a two-finger Graco contractor gun. We're gonna slide it into the uh, holder here on the end of the pole. You wanna kind of scoot the gun down to where this mechanism is lined up with the middle of your trigger here. And then I'm just gonna turn this screw until that is securely attached. Kind of crank that down. The next thing you're gonna do is you can slide uh, this mechanism back to the point where it's kind of lightly resting on the trigger and secure that as well. So after you have the gun firmly secured in there, you can use these clips just to hold your hose out of the way and make sure that's firmly secured onto the gun. And you're all set up and ready to spray. So we're using the four to six foot extension pole. Um, you have a little cam here on the side that you can release and the pole extends right out and then just make sure you firmly secure that cam and that prevents the gun from spinning around too much when you're spraying. And you got a little fabric sleeve to cover it here so you don't get overspray inside the mechanism of the pole. So when we're spraying, you know, we always use this as a tool to just help us reach up to high places. One key to using the spray pole effectively is just make sure you're using the right one for the job that you're doing. You know, any extra length on the pole that isn't needed to reach up to where you're going is just gonna be extra weight that the guys are gonna be fighting all day, so. When we bring a new tool like this on site, we always try to mix it up. You know, sometimes I'll just give it to the guys and see what they come up with. Jimmy is also the best guy in the world to get out here and start using stuff. So um, he really plays a key role in bringing a new tool on and making sure that everybody's using it in the right way. My name is Jimmy Ruiz. I'm uh, the production manager of Almond Painting. So you can see here, Jimmy is able to keep a wet edge without having to move ladders and stuff around. He can just pop the pole off and keep spraying. The big difference between the Hyde spray pole and the other spray poles on the market is this one is a completely separate unit that's not attached to your sprayer, so it doesn't have any paint in the system. You can pull it on and off whenever you want. Now that Jimmy's gotten everything that he could spray up top, you know, he can just pop the spray gun out of there and keep spraying this stuff down low. So one of the things you just got to watch out for with this spray pole is, you know, you are putting the gun up on top of a big lever and when you first pull the trigger, it's gonna kick back a lot more than you're used to when you normally spray. So it's just something you gotta kinda learn a little bit and adjust to in your spraying style. But it's really easy to get set up and start using right out of the box. You know, in my opinion, the biggest benefit of using the Hyde Quick Reach Telescopic Spray Pole is just being able to keep my guys safe. You know, we're dealing with a bunch of issues out here where we're trying to reach up to the top of a building where even our 60 foot ladder won't reach, or we're trying to reach around on the side of decks and fight hills and rocks and all that kind of stuff. So the best thing about this is it just extends our reach, you know, another four or six or 12 feet and allows us to get out to things that we wouldn't have even tried before. Thanks guys for watching Paint TV. If you liked the video that you saw, be sure to hit like and subscribe. And if you're a pro painter, make sure that you are subscribed to American Painting Contractor.